Hello, I'm Dave Adams, and Kevin Baird and I are getting ready to go to Franklin County Jail Museum in Benton, Illinois, and we're going to introduce the new companion to Bob Ray, who is the head of the uh, Benton Historical Society. And it's a nice day, and we'll see you there. Hi, I'm Kevin Baird, and I'm at the Haunted Jail in Benton, Illinois, and I'm here with Mr. Ray. This is Mr. Ray over here. Yeah, I'm Bob Ray, and I'm the president of the Franklin County Historic Preservation Society, and uh, the site where we're standing is the, uh, it was built in 1905, and in 1928 it was the site of the uh, last public hanging in the state of Illinois. And the person hanged was incarcerated here for one year, uh, or billed as the most haunted uh, jail definitely in Illinois, and a lot of paranormal things have happened here. Yeah, so I'm Kevin Baird and I designed this device here. I'm sure the people who are following us on you know, YouTube and Twitter and what have you already know about the new companion, but I'm going to be placing, donating a new companion to the museum here in Benton, Illinois with phrases that are relative to this establishment that would have been said over the years. So if there's any spirits or ghosts or people who don't have bodies anymore that want to be able to get their message across, they can do it using the hundred plus phrases that are programmed into the new companion so they can have dialogues with people who come to visit and want to share in the experience that makes up this you know, a little pocket of reality, right? So this is the new companion, and it's really the first actual physical on-site test that's been done at an actually known haunted kind of facility. And how the device works is that there it is sensitive to DC energies and frequencies and power that's in the atmosphere, it's similar to what Tesla was playing with when he was trying to create free power for everybody. Well the spirits that are out there interact with that same kind of DC kind of power and energy and that the new companion is sensitive to DC power. Well the atmosphere that's around us that Tesla tried to access is DC, right, direct current, and that the ghosts when they move around, they sort of move around like fish in an ocean of energy and that they have sort of like a finite pocket of energy that makes up who they are but when they're attracted to something like the new companion or a camera that has you know the battery on it that's also DC they like to eat that energy up well with the cameras they become dry like that but with this device it can feed them and help them be stronger at what they do and get to know the new companion and be able to interact in the environment a lot better than if it didn't exist. So the new companion is basically an energy generator. It creates maybe like a singularity, if you will. Let me just use that as like a fun term to where things can come in, energies, sentiences, consciousnesses can come in and sort of like be empowered to say the things that they want to say and maybe get some things off their chest. So we're going to try and see how that works here at the Benton Jail. So, Mr. Ray, do you have anything that you want to add to that? We're just this is a quick introduction, and we'll be doing more videos later. Well, we're I say we're excited about this because, as I understand, you're going to put in key phrases that could be used, or they could uh, repeat, or learn how to communicate with. Right. So, it, uh, and then at a later stage, we could uh, put a live cam on this so people could uh, observe this. I yes. Think we're honored that this would be. Yeah. A, yeah. Decide one of the first. Uh, yeah, would, we could do 24 hour streaming to where people around the world could just tune in and watch it operate and see what happens. We could also get it set up to where there would be a, a uh, one of those night vision cameras to where you can see spirit, you know, orbs and mists and that kind of stuff fly around it at night. Probably in nighttime would be a great time for viewing it as well. So, this is the new companion at the Benton Jail. Like, what's a good web go-to address? Oh, www.historicjail.com. Historicjail.com. Right. To find out more about it. And we're in Benton, Illinois. Southern Illinois. I want to...
This is Dave Adams. He's the background camera guy. Talk, Dave. No, oh, I just wanted to say hi, and uh, we're just trying to educate everyone on exactly what this is, and, and trying to introduce it to the world. So, there's no other device like this anywhere. So this is brand new technology that's going to be developed, and it's yeah. just going to keep expanding. Exactly. All right. Yeah. All right, until pe all right, people, until next time, we'll keep you up to date. Stay tuned. We're at the Benton Channel. I'm Kevin Baird, and this is Mr. Ray. Have a good day.